Hi everyone, I'm Beth, and today I'm going to take you through a Arms Express class. So for today's class, all you need is a set of light weights. So today I'm using two pounds, but you can use anywhere between one and three pounds. Um, generally, I start with two, and then sometimes if I need to switch out to one pounder, that's what I do. So just listen to your body today, lower those arms whenever you need to. We're just going to start by warming up. So let's go ahead and lift those arms and lower. So I want you to pull up from your core, just lifting and lowering those arms. Now, take the momentum out of the movement. So because you have these light weights, you might feel like you can just whip them up and whip them down, but I want you to take all of that uh, momentum out of the movement. All right, so we just wanna start moving them in every direction. One more in this direction, now let's open them up laterally. Good. As you bring those arms down, I want you to think about squeezing from your side body and really pulling down. And then as you take those arms up, keep those shoulders down. Good job. Excellent. So we're just lifting them to shoulder height and then pulling them right back down. You got it, about 10 more seconds. And then we're gonna take big circles here. Last five, four, three, two, and one, we're gonna take them up. We're gonna take them out. We're gonna bring them down. Forward, side, and down. You got it. Good. So this whole time I want you to think about pulling up from your core, keeping your shoulders lowered away from your ears, but standing as tall as you can, like you're growing from the crown of your head. Good. Last four, three, two, and one. Let's go ahead and reverse that. Take it out. Bring it forward, lower it down. So hopefully you're starting to feel this in your shoulders. I'm gonna build those strong shoulders, avoiding any injuries as we age. Beautiful. About 10 more seconds if we've warmed up these arms and then we're gonna go ahead and get started. Last five, four, Three, two, one, good. All right, let's go ahead and bicep curl those arms. Now for these bicep curls, we wanna bring those elbows up to shoulder height. But if you feel that your shoulders start to inch up, then you can bring those arms down, but I want you to keep the arms away from the body. So don't tuck them in, bring them out. Makes it a little bit harder and isolates that bicep. Excellent. Good. Last five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here. A little pulse up. So keep those wrists right over those elbows. Try not to bend at the wrists, okay? So keep them nice and straight. No breaks in the wrist. You got it. We're going to take these arms out next for that lateral bicep curl. In three, two, one. Just open those arms, bicep curl. So as you can see, those light weights start to get heavy pretty fast. So you listen to your body. When you need your breaks, you just lower those arms and jump back in when you're ready. Remember to pull up from the core. Keep that breath going. All right, a few more seconds here, and we're gonna pulse it up. Last five, four, three, two, one. Pulse it up. Keep the shoulders down, keep the chest lifted. Try to close up your rib cage. So you might feel your rib cage sort of splaying open. Try to close it up. You'll tuck that belly button in, and you'll keep that core engaged too. All right, next up, we're gonna take this into an overhead press. In two, one, take those palms forward, lift it up, bring it down, up and down. Beautiful. Very nice, in 15 seconds, we're gonna go into a skull crusher, hitting those triceps. So giving those shoulders a little bit of a break here. Well, active recovery, I like to say, in four, three, two, one. Keep those arms up, 
Go ahead, keep those elbows pointed towards your screen. There, always cracks. Always gotta get that elbow crack in there. You got it. So we wanna exhaust these arms. We're gonna move into that hug and moon next. So we'll keep those arms lifted and then we're gonna open them out to the side. In three, two, one, open them out. Take them right back up and out and up. Nice job. Good. So we're gonna bring these arms down next. Just a little bit of a break there. We don't want our form to suffer. We're gonna go into those angel arms next. In three, two, one. Bring those arms down. One arm goes forward, one arm goes out. Nice job. This is an easy one to start swinging. So I want you to take the swing out. and then keep those shoulders down. Excellent, you've got it. The last three, two, and one. Good, take those arms in. So you've got your arms in a 90 degree angle. I want you to take them out and in. So it's a push and a pull. So you can take this in front of you if you like, or you can take it up where the ceiling and the wall meet. Good. So I start reach and pull. You got it. Last five, four, three, two, one. Good job. We're gonna take both weights in one hand. We're gonna hinge over. Hit, um, so belly's pulling in, pull that elbow up, and go ahead and extend and bend, extend. So push the hips way back, you got it. You pull the core in, you keep it nice and lifted. When you hit the tricep, try to keep that elbow right where it is. Excellent. Got a few more seconds here, last five, four, three, two and one let's switch sides here we go take that elbow nice and high so no push-ups today no dips today but we are hitting those triceps excellent keep going squeeze so you want to extend that arm as much as possible push those hips way back pull that belly all the way in back is nice and flat be careful if you are hypermobile that you do not overextend or hyperextend that elbow. Last five, four, three, two, one. Good job. All right, here we go. We'll take those arms out. Little circles. Good. Little circles forward. Don't mind Phineas in the background. Always barking. Little circles forward. And keep them lifted, but pull those shoulders down. You can do it. Last five, four, three, two, one. All right, turn those palms over. We're gonna kick it out. Out, in, out, in, good. As those arms open out, try to keep those ribs closed. You'll feel that belly button really pulling back towards your spine. Engaging that core. Excellent. Almost there. Last five, four, three, two, one. Take those arms forward, little circles. So we're relaxing the shoulders, pulling up from the core, pull the shoulder blades back. You can do it. 15 more seconds, little circles. We're gonna go into our goal post after this. In five, four, three, two, one.
bend those arms. It's right closes, left closes, both. Right, left, both. Right, left, both. Nice job. Keeping them lifted to shoulder height. We're gonna go into our alternating overhead press next. Hold it here, our right goes up, left goes up, both. Right, left, both. Right, left, both. Good, nearly there. 10 more seconds. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Excellent. One last tricep here. We're going to hinge it over. So push the hips way back. Elbows come up. We're going to row up. I guess I can show it to you this way. Good. Do you want that chest to be lifted? Try not to pull the head up though. So I'm looking at the camera, but keep that neck in line with the spine. You're pulling those shoulder blades together like they have a magnet. Good. They reach in front of us. Keeping the back nice and flat and pull up. Wonderful. We're going to switch this into a fly. In five, four, three, two, one. Out to the side. So working that back body. You want a strong back. You can do it. Almost there. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Go ahead and stand it up. Roll those shoulders back. That was so good, you guys. Okay, I'm gonna set these weights down and then let's stretch out those arms. So take that right arm out to the side, bring it across, bring the shoulder down. Give it just a little bit of a hug. That was a lot of shoulder work today. And then you can look over to each side, open out the arms, bring that other arm across, bring that shoulder down. Big deep breaths, good, okay. Bring those arms behind you, reach away. As if someone is pulling those arms behind you, pull that belly button in, you'll be able to down. Nice job, just roll out those wrists, open up those hands. Really nice job today, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. We got it in, work those arms, and I hope to see you back here real soon.